What's up guys? Welcome back to a new video today. We are doing top five landing spots for running back Delvin Cook. Um, he got released from the Vikings a few months ago. And there has been many teams interested in him. He, I believe he said he didn't want to sign anywhere until after training camp uh, or after mini camp. So, and I th believe mini camp is also done. Yeah, it is. And by the time this video gets out, it'll definitely be done. Um, but to start out at number five is the Bills. The reason that they need him is the Bills need a running game to put the stress off Josh Allen. Because if Josh Allen's their main runner, Josh Allen's their main quarterback, right? He has to throw the ball and run the ball. He's going to be out of the league in two years because he's going to have injuries and everything like that. Maybe not out of the league, but he'll, he won't be that good. No, I'm a big Josh Allen fan because I am from Wyoming and he went to college at Wyoming. So... But, yeah, I'm sure you guys have heard me in the past talk about him. But I think he would work perfect at the Bills. Um, his brother James is there. They got a – then I mean, he is an older running back, Elvin Cook. He's 27. Um, he would work perfect with – you know, he, he wouldn't have to run all the time, you know, so that would cause him to not get injured more because he's older. So if they're using Delvin James – um, I think Zach Moss is still there, and using those three all different runs, mainly, mainly Dalvin, and then secondary James. You know, not all, not fully use Dalvin Cook. He'll last this whole year and maybe bring him to a Super Bowl. They'll definitely be in the playoffs though. But even without Dalvin Cook, but running back is the position that the Bills need, and that solves it. Now number four is the Ravens. The Ravens just, they need a running back. Now, they got their receiving core. They got their guy, their targets for Lamar. They do got running backs, but they need a big running back, right? They need a running back that they hand the ball off, can get yards, you know, and they don't have to use Lamar Jackson. Kind of the same thing with uh, Josh Allen, okay? Lamar's running a lot, throwing a lot. He's the main guy. So, they bring in Dalvin Cook, he becomes their runner. And even, sh same with the Bills, kind of shares snaps with J.K. Dobbins. But Dalvin Cook's the main running back. Or even you split him up half and half a little bit, maybe a little bit more to Dalvin Cook. Um, but then, yeah, and they need that running back. They can get the first down on the third down in a few yards or whatever, the second down. Or whatever. They need a running back that can get the first down. The number three is the Carolina Panthers. Now, they haven't had a good running back since Christian McCaffrey a year ago. Or not even a year ago. You know, it was start of this last season. They need um they would make that would make them a bigger team. That would make them potentially with Maybe potentially a, a playoff team if they really can prove themselves and uh, Bryce Young can actually be a quarterback that they say he's going to be. They can potentially be a playoff caliber offense. And their defense is good. No, that should bring them up. And then to make, to make the um, – I don't know about being a playoff team with Dalvin Cook, but it brings – it helps Bryce Young – it helps the running Chubba Hubbard, you know, maybe teach him a little bit. Um, it just helps all around. And now for number two, they have a running back that they just paid a lot of money for and released their old starter, the Dallas Cowboys. Now, Tony Pollard, the reason that I say signed Allen Cook, and I am a big fan of Tony Pollard, I think he can do it. But he is coming off a pretty bad injury injury of his fibula. And so I think it's a little up and down if he's going to be good or if he's going to be bad. Um, you know, because running backs, when they get injured on their legs, you know, they can start declining. 
And but if you do bring in Dalvin Cook and Tony Pollard is like mid, then you use them half and half, or same as I said with uh, uh, James Cook and Dalvin Cook with the Bills, or same with I said with the Ravens. That like that. The Cowboys do need a running back if Tony Pollard is not him, if, cannot do it with his injury, and Dalvin Cook is the answer. Now, for the first one, and it's been all over, and I don't know, but I would like it because I'm a Patriots fan and they're rivals, but the Miami Dolphins. It, he's had pretty high uh, reason or saying he wants to go to the Dolphins. Um, He's had uh, kind of like cryptic tweets and Instagram posts and everything like that. It's kind of pointing towards the Dolphins. The Dolphins have been really interested in him. And the reason that it would make the Dolphins better and make him good is the Dolphins are already a big team. They got Jalen Ramsey. They got Tyreek Hill. They got Jalen Waddle. They got um, Xavier Howard. Uh, they got uh, Javon Holland. Big defense. Their offense is good. Uh, maybe a little better run, or quarterback, but their one thing they're missing is a good running back. And Dalvin Cook answers that, and they are a Super Bowl contender, I believe, if they get Dalvin Cook. They are already a playoff contender. Without Dalvin Cook, I believe they are a Super Bowl contender with Dalvin Cook. Now, guys, that was my video for top five teams that Dalvin Cook could go to hope you guys enjoyed comment down below where do you think Dalvin Cook will end up and I'll see you in the next video so peace